Tell me about your marriage to Steve Parker and what you know, well, maybe not specifically uh, about your marriage, but what you know about relationships. Because you approach, you had a very unconventional marriage, but a very long and in many ways successful marriage. Mm. And I'm very curious, if, if I came to you today and I said, I'm getting married how should I shape well, that's the your relationship? First mistake. Okay, <laughs> let's go from there. We were friends, and I guess you could say uh, practiced an open marriage in 1954, which was shocking at the time. Which was what another lifetime, and no one understood it. We did. I, he lived in Japan, basically. I lived in America working and this and that. We'd meet up, always great friends, travel sometimes together. Uh, I think that's the basis uh, for a, a long-lasting marriage if you really want to do such a thing. I would say better to stay friends and... And we can't. We don't have enough time to talk about the sexuality of it all. I'm, I'm going to tell. You, I was very open about all of that, and so was he. I'm having a relationship now that is teaching me about possessiveness with intimacy, and it's with my three dogs. <laughs> oh, look at all the shocked faces! <laughs> I adore my dogs, and I've had to get. A dog nanny food lady for the dogs because I've been working so much. And, you know, you can't leave them alone. So my doggies would cuddle up with me every night. And now they go to the nanny food lady (laughs) and sleep with her. So what are you doing about that? Uh, It is tough. I'm not kidding you. It is tough. They will come and jump up and cuddle and say, oh, it's so great you're home for a few hours. And then they go off and sleep with her. Totally indiscreet. (laughs) Totally indiscreet. And she's got bacon in her pocket, which is just leading them on. I am really (laughs) learning what people will do (laughs) for food. (laughs) The lesson keeps coming, doesn't it? But this is huge for me. I mean it. You've never felt jealousy a lot in your life, and suddenly you're feeling it. I think it's it. jealousy. I think it's, oh, <laughs> wait a minute. I've had you. I've had one 17 years, and you're going off with her? I mean, it's big time stuff. <laughs> so I'm learning, oh, i got to do what's best for the babies. 